idea of strategizing future of multifamily real estate or real estate altogether and what we're going to do for the next five years, 10 years. I'm not sure what the, what the exact dates are, but the idea is current AI and robotics development or companies going to try to switch from humans to robots. So what's really is going to happen? We're in multifamily uh, real estate, right? We get money from people paying rent. If people are start losing jobs, they are not, they're no longer able to pay, uh, to pay our rent. So what really is going to happen? People will start losing jobs. People are going to start paying less and less and less for, to put themselves back together and understand that they got to go and fend for their families. So they got to figure this thing out and what they will start doing. And somewhere here, people will start going back to schools. This, well, this is as well. It's probably the, one of the best businesses to be in. It's probably school of some sort, right? Technical college where you can t learn robotics and you can, um, and you can learn programming of robotics. More and more people start getting new jobs and multifamily is back online. I'm not sure if this starts in 2027. Not sure if this ends. I don't know the dates yet, but this is what's going to happen. What's going to happen at the same time in the industrial world? You have a manufacturing facility uh, of 6,000 square feet. Now uh, there's a manufacturer who comes in and they say, okay, now you need to bring robots if you want to be uh, three times more effective than you were before. You got to let your people go. Or someone like Smartland goes out, buys the, buys the place, completely prepares it, new floors, tile floors, uh, LED lighting, everything's new, doors, uh, new, doors new, overhead doors are new, windows are new. Now, this owner wants to move to a different place. So I'm assuming what's going to happen in industrial spaces, again, it's assumption, that right about here where this goes down, this goes up. So industrial space rent and movement, it goes up and the prices go up because the moment multifamily in this environment is going to go down, the uh, industrial is, uh, is probably going to go up. We're talking about this because this is our strategy for a new fund. So now you know. New fund strategy is, um, is going to be SFR, multifamily, and uh, industrial. 6,000 square feet. So we already bought a 6,000 6, square feet warehouse in Eastlake, uh, and we're completely redesigning it exactly as I, uh, as I explained we should, and this is going to be our uh, a test run. Uh, there's 6,000 6, square feet. We're replacing floors, um, new ceilings. Uh, repainting walls, just making, making everything shiny, LED lights, uh, new, uh, new AC system, new um, air scrubbing systems with uh, HEPA filters, and uh, everything's airtight, and I believe this is, we're going to be able to get the $5 a square foot more. Every, every single potential is going to be every single manufacturer that you walk through, and you see oil on the floor, um, Holes in windows, holes in uh, ceilings that they don't care about, the old electricals, those are all the customers. And actually, I was, you remember, I was at the robotics conference. I saw those robots, but there, it was five years ago. They were 100% capable of replacing people. I don't know why it didn't kick in, but they were absolutely capable. This robotic industry, it, it works like this. Everything has a really, really slow start, but then uh, critical mass, start picking that up and it just goes like this probably. So I don't know where we are here, but five years ago I was, I saw really capable robots. Expensive. Technology at first expensive, more technology you're creating or not, not more technology, more, more of the same product you're creating, the cheaper it becomes. So at first there were million, they were talking about million dollar uh, conveyor lines. Now we're talking about $250,000 conveyor lines, right? So that's becoming, becoming more and more affordable for businesses. Uh, plus, not everyone is uh, early adopter. We also have AI. AI is definitely going to start speeding up the robotics process because I think we should take what we have and post it. And post it. A little music in, in the background, a little text, and see where we get out of it. The reason, oh, the reason why we even wanted to do this, because what I'm saying right now, it is very much um, geographically local opinion based, right? Like, I don't know what's going on in California. I don't know what's going on in Florida uh, with warehouses. I can just see the warehouses that we're buying here, and this is my assumption. 
But once we post there, and if we bring people to that video, you'll have people crawling from everywhere and leaving comments and saying how stupid this is, how smart this is, uh, their opinions on it. Maybe somebody's already tried it. So I think just posting this just to get people comments, that was my original idea.